Welcome to Southern Swag Outdoors LLC and today is Tipsy Tuesday and today I'm going to be showing you the correct way to hold and operate an open face reel. This is called an open face reel because the spool on the reel is exposed so open face reel. Uh, on a closed face reel the spool is inside the reel you can't see it. On a bait caster reel the spool is exposed but it's enclosed inside the reel itself. But on the open face, it's sitting on top of the reel, the spool, and you can see it all. So, first of all, I'm going to show you the incorrect way to operate an open face reel. The reason I'm going to do this is because a lot of people hold their reel like this. You might even do it if you're watching this video, but I'm going to show you the correct way, and I'm going to show you why you probably do that. So, a lot of people hold their reel like this, an open face reel, with the reel on top, and they're reeling back towards themselves. That's incorrect. The first indication of this, if you're really in a reel and you're really back towards yourself, towards yourself, that's incorrect. You have the reel upside down nine times out of ten. The correct way to hold the reel, the open face reel, is with the reel facing down and you're going to be reeling forward to bring your line back in. Now, let me show you why people do this. A lot of re The reason a lot of people hold it like this is because they want their handle in their right hand. And a lot of times when you buy the open face reel, if you hold it correctly, the handle's gonna be on your left. So they hold it up like this, when you hold it incorrectly upside down, now the handle's on your right, it's in your right hand. You don't feel comfortable holding it, but you feel comfortable using your right hand. I'm gonna show you how to eliminate that. So you wanna hold your reel upside down. There's a little screw on one side of the reel. The screws in one side, you wanna screw that out. Then you're able to Take your handle out, and you can just switch it to the opposite side. And you put the screw back in. Now you're holding the rod and reel correctly with the, the reel facing down on the bottom of the rod, and you're reeling forward. Now you're using your right hand, still in your right hand, the handle, but you're holding it correctly, and you're reeling forward. Now let me show you one more thing. This is a bait caster. The reel sits on top. But you're still reeling forward. That's the correct way. If you have it like this, and you're reeling backwards, you're holding it incorrect. Another way you can tell is on the bait caster, you have a little grip, and on the closed face usually, you have a little grip brace on the back of the rod. Look like a little trick. I call it a trigger grip. But and that's for extra grip on the rod. And you put your two fingers around, you get an extra grip on that rod. And you're gonna be reeling forward on any reeling rod you use. Now, on the open face. You don't have that if you're holding it like this. But if you're holding it correct, the base of the reel becomes that extra brace that you put your fingers around. You got it like this, and you're reeling forward. So you always want to reel forward on the open face. And the face in the rod, the reel itself should be facing down. Up like this, reeling backwards is incorrect. So hopefully you learned something. Something swag outdoors. We love and appreciate y'all.